three things that voters are telling you that's mostly on their minds? Yeah, we're in the middle of a two-week tour right now. We're going to go to 50 stops, uh, over 30 counties, and what I'm hearing so far is, is what I've heard you know, over the last six years in Ohio, which is we've got to get this economy moving. Still, if you look at the first two quarters this year, we're about 1% growth. And what happens is people's wages don't go up when you have that kind of a weak economy. So wages are flat. Last night I was in Shelby County. People were saying to me, Rob, you know, work hard, play by the rules. I'm doing everything right, and my wages haven't gone up in years. And uh, my, my expenses are way up, particularly because of Obamacare. Uh, Health care costs have shot through the roof. We're looking at 10 to 39 percent increases in premiums in Ohio next year. Who can afford that? We just had Aetna pull out of Ohio, which is going to create less competition on the exchanges. Uh, we already had the public option here in Ohio, as it's called, the co-op, go belly up, which left uh, thousands of Ohio families without health care. So that combination of weak economy, lower wages, and increased expenses, that middle class squeeze is something I hear about everywhere I go. You've probably heard the news that the man at the top of the ticket, Donald Trump, is, is doing some shopping.